John McCain's daughter, Meghan McCain, has proven once again that she is not afraid to headbutt the extremists on the conservative side of the aisle. After former Congressman Tom Tancredo called for literacy tests for voting at the Tea Party convention last week, Meghan McCain was quick to call him out on it. And this, it's innate racism, and I think it's why young people are turned off by this movement. And I'm sorry, revolutions start with young people, not with 65-year-old people talking about literacy tests and people who can't say the word vote in English. It's ridiculous. Right on cue, Les Phillip, a self-identified Tea Party Republican, went looking for Meghan McCain's head because of that, putting out a statement that said, quote, Ms. McCain has led a life of privilege and couldn't understand the pressures of living from paycheck to paycheck. I respect her father's service to this country, but she ridicules what she cannot understand. The allegation is that if Meghan McCain weren't so privileged, she'd understand wanting to bring back Jim Crow era voting literacy tests that were used for generations in this country to deny black people the right to vote. That's according to, again, this guy named Les Phillip, uh, who is a Tea Party candidate challenging incumbent Congressman Parker Griffith in Alabama's 5th District. And it turns out that Parker Griffith is at the center of another quite strange political squabble.